Hi, I'm Jinnal. And I'm Crystal. We're students at Imperial College London. We're here to share our top tips on how to prepare for your undergraduate interview. We know that lots of people worry about interviews, but try to remember, interviewers want you to do well. They aren't trying to catch you out and will encourage you to do your best. I know my interview ended up feeling more like a conversation about a subject that I'm really interested in. So, relax and be yourself. Take time to think before answering questions and don't be afraid to ask if you need anything repeated. Remember, it's an opportunity for the interviewer to get to know you, but also for you to get to know the college better too. The format of your interview will depend on the subject and course you're applying for. You may be interviewed as part of a group or one-to-one. -one. No matter if your interview is in-person or online, you should treat it the same. You'll be contacted ahead of your interview with everything you need to know. But if you have any questions, contact the admissions team in the department that you're applying to. There are things you can do to ensure you're as prepared as possible for your interview. It's a good idea to read through your personal statement to remind yourself about what you wrote. It's impossible to know exactly what you'll be asked, but interviewers will want to know why you've applied to study at Imperial and why you're interested in this particular course. Try to have a clear idea of why you're passionate about the subject and what you would bring to Imperial. Ultimately, have a think about what makes you unique and will make you stand out from other applicants. Have as many practice interviews as you can. Ask your family, friends, teachers, or even your neighbours if they can run through some practice questions with you. Even talking to an empty room will help you get used to speaking aloud and in detail about your subject. This is definitely a technique I use during my interview preparation and I found that helped a lot. It's also a good idea to have a think about any questions you want to ask, either about Imperial or the course specifically. Remember, it's your chance to get to know us a bit better too. If your interview's in person, figure out how you're going to get to campus and familiarise yourself with the journey. Plan to arrive early. This will give you the chance to get used to your surroundings and find out where you're supposed to go. It will also allow a bit of time if you're unexpectedly delayed. It's a good idea to book your travel in advance to secure cheaper fares. Some departments offer reimbursements for travel costs to interviews for eligible students. Double check this with the admissions team in the department you're applying to. We know things can happen that are outside of your control. Train cancellations, traffic delays, these things happen. If you're running late to your interview, don't panic. Call the admissions team and explain your situation. In some circumstances, your interview could be moved to a later time or rearranged for a different day. You don't need to dress up for your interview. Just make sure you're wearing something you feel comfortable in. Bring a bottle of water with you and finally, try to relax. If your interview is online, find a quiet place where you won't be disturbed. This could be at home, in school, or even at a friend or family member's house. Just remember to let anyone in the space know you're having your interview so they don't disturb you. Check that you have a strong internet connection and that your microphone and camera are working. It's also a good idea to do a test call beforehand. Whether you're using a computer, laptop or tablet, make sure it's fully charged or plugged in. Treat the interview as if it's in person. Wear something appropriate but that you'll feel comfortable in. If you have technical issues during the interview, stay calm and explain what's happening. Have the contact number for the admissions team available in case you have any problems. The most important thing to remember is to be yourself. Show your passion for your subject and try to enjoy it. Best of luck with your interview.